welcome, welcome back to channel 13, the lucky number. Welcome to Fire Jamaica and Foul Mouth. My name is Vicky, your foreign shopping expert on board a beautiful harmony of this is. But today we are in a special place. Today we are in Casa del Abano. For those of you who love to smoke your cigars, so cigars are fiction others. This is the place you want to be. But today, very important, today we have a very special uh, guest that I'd like to introduce you. And today we have the owner of La Casa de Labano, Mr. Raj Kumar. For the friends, Mr. Raj. Right here, Mr. Raj. Hi. Hi. Nice to see you again, Mr. Hi. Raj. Nice How are you today? Welcome. Please come in. Thank you, thank you. So here we are today in La Casa de Labano. As you can see here, this is the place where you want to be. And on top of that, the beautiful Pumi door inside. We keep the right temperature of your cigars. Let's take a look together. Mr. Raj, please come in. Thank you. All right, folks, take a look inside. Wow. This place for a cigar smoker is like a kid in candy store. The kind of collection we have is based in the entire Caribbean. Mr. Raj, is, are these uh, cigars all Cuban cigars? Only Cuban. Only Cuban cigars. Being La Casa de La Habano, we are not allowed to touch any other cigar in this store. Incredible, incredible. Every single cigar that is in here is come from Cuba. Now give us some um, some brands, some most well-known brands for the cigars aficionados like you sir. Well, this brand Cohiba is the best and most expensive brand in the world. On top of that, Cuba increased the price of Cohiba, Trinidad, and all other special and limited edition cigars by hooping 150% two and a half months ago. So this is meant for 1% of the world population. Of course, it's super expensive, but we do have less expensive cigars. Famous brand like Monte Cristo, Patagas, Hoffman, Trinidad, Punch, Romeo Juliet, you name it, we have it. If we don't have any Cuban cigar, means there's a bit, very little chance you can find it anywhere in the world. <laughs> and of course, not only you have the brands, but you have a different variety of the same brand. Definitely. And, so, what are the main differences in so when it comes to cigars? I know that you have the different wrappers and you have medium robust, etc. Yeah, so all these cigars normally come in three different categories smoke wise or strength wise those are mild which is meant for beginners or occasional smoker medium for somebody who smokes maybe once a week or on weekends and full body cigar are for somebody who smokes every day or multi multiple cigars every day interesting and we have different different sizes also it's not that only big size cigar is strong, of course. You can have smaller strong cigar also, a bigger, lighter cigar also. So this is the beauty of Cuban cigar, that they make the cigar for every time, every occasion, and to pair with whatever you are drinking or eating. There's a cigar who's good to smoke after dinner, but same cigar, if you smoke it, during the morning hours, it might spin your head. Who would like to smoke a morning cigar? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so you understand that it is a complete new world. But remember, this is not only for the cigars aficionados, but also for your friends and family. You can get a gift to take home with you. Now, what we're gonna do, if it's okay with you, Mr. Raj, I'd like to have a seat with you, maybe go through some of the special cigars here in the store and learn a little more about cigars. Anytime, anytime. Yeah? You can ask as many as questions you want. Thank you. I'll give you honest and right answer. Thank you so much, Mr. Raj. All right, stay tuned. We're gonna have a nice little interview in just a few minutes. Thank you. And welcome back to channel 13, the lucky number. And welcome, we are still at the Casa de La Bano. My name is Vicky, a foreign shopping expert on board. Now we're having an incredible interview with Mr. Raj Kumar. For friends, Mr. Raj, the owner of La Casa de La Bano. Mr. Raj, great to have you again. And thank you so much for the time 
uh, for all our guests on board. Let Now, you know. the Harmony of the Seas would like to learn a little more and if you could share some of your knowledge about cigars. Um, so, let us know a little more, where do cigars come from? Or why do we get to start smoke cigars and not cigarettes? Why cigars are still something that we cherish so much differently than cigarettes or any other? Well, very good questions. Cuban cigars are considered the best in the world. The reason being, it is oldest in the world. Cuban cigars started before Christopher Columbus visited Cuba in 1492. Now, 500 plus years of manufacturing, smoking and distributing the cigars is more than any research and development. 500 years. Incredible. They have become experts in these 500 years passing on to one generation to another to another and another developing the quality of tobacco, quality of cigar and what not. It's like a heirloom almost, a tradition generation of the generation. So true. The Cuban cigars are especially best in the world for another reason that the weather, the sunlight, the rain, the soil of Cuba is most ideal to produce the best tobacco. Tobacco plants, makes yeah. sense. And so, and if you don't mind me asking, is this the reason why Cuban cigars are so well renowned in the industry and sought after by cigars aficionados? One of the reasons, one of the reasons, it takes lot of sweat and blood to produce one cigar. Before it reaches to a smoker, it goes to 64 heads. 64 from heads. Feet to the box. That's incredible. The craftsmanship behind it, the, the amount of hours put into creating this almost work of art, I would say. Yeah. So, what are the, you know, we mentioned the, the brand's name uh, earlier. Is there a, a, a difference into the making of the cigars between brands or are both of the same done? Definitely, big difference. Big difference. Say for example, Cohiba is the most sought after and most expensive cigar in the world. I have these three boxes of Cohiba Bahiki on the counter. Baiki 52, 54, 56. These cigars are best and most expensive in the world for their quality. They use best tobacco produced in Cuba to manufacture these cigars. They use best rollers Wolves. to produce these cigars. On top of that, tobacco for Cohiba goes to three thorough fermentation processes. Each fermentation process takes six months time and what it does to the cigar brings down the tar and nicotine to almost zero level. Wow, okay. So when you're that smoking is, a cigar, so you're not smoking nicotine or tar? Almost nothing. Well, here you go, ladies and gentlemen. Now you will know a little more about cigars and the difference between cigar and smoking just regular cigarettes out there. And we learned something about the brands, a little more about the way this uh, work of art, I would say, that are made in Cuba. And here you can find only real Cuban cigars. Not only this is the recommended store by Royal Caribbean, so you know you can get authentic items. But also, you have Mr. Raj Kumar, they can always explain you and give you and share his knowledge with you, which I believe adds a lot of value when we are uh, shopping for cigars. I strongly encourage you when you're visiting Falma to visit this store in uh, on the terminal which is a steps off the gangway. Remember just one minute walking off the gangway and visit this store on the terminal. This is La Casa de la 